Welcome back to the Hank Strange Situation, Lifestyles of the Locked and Loaded. Make sure to check out HankStrange.com. You can sign up for our email list and find ways to follow and support our efforts. Somebody asked, what am I ED seeing? So can I whip that out? Nah, I'm just kidding. I, know better. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that moment of panic. <laughs> I was like, wait a second. I, I know you know better than this. <laughs> I was like, is he really? I'd love to show you guys, but uh, YouTube what is getting, you know. Yeah, what is getting whipped out over here? Uh, yeah. No, don't whip it out, Mac. We don't need to see it, okay? This no, is not. Even the holster. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is not Boogie Nights. This is not Boogie Nights. <laughs> <laughs> I can show you my pocket knife. I don't think they have a, a rule oh, against my okay, pocket fine. knives. <laughs> fine. Okay. Uh, Joseph Anthony gave us five bucks. Thanks a lot, Joseph Anthony. Okay, let's see the knife. All right, so this? here's the back side of it. Ooh. Yes, Microtech. There's the front side of it. Mm. Awesome, awesome. The dirt. Microtech Damn. dirt. Very cool. Okay. Yeah, I love this little guy. They, they think, finally put the I little comes out with button on the right side of it, right? So yeah. usually with the... It's right there, yeah. Yeah, yep. Like that. It's usually on the side, and they put it right there on the, the face of it, so when you draw it out of your pocket, your thumb's yeah. right on the button. Uh, all the microtechs really are coming out now. Look at that. Boom. So, microtechs coming out. This is all. See, okay. Microtech's just the way to go with all Everyone put a microtech up on the screen right now. Let's see. There you go. Boom. By the way, no, mine, no. mine is the best. Check. Can you see that? Can you see the logo on that thing? Yeah, I do. I see that. Wow. That's the Hank Strange logo on there. Special. Did somebody laser that for you? Yeah. <laughs> no, microtechs are awesome. But you're right. I know Lola actually likes those microtechs that have it flat there like what yours is, Mac. Yeah, she says it's these ones. E I R C. Just, yeah, these are just too. You know, she doesn't like, like you know. She does, I guess she doesn't have the thumb strength. So is that a? Is that a, a combat turn on or? No, a, this is this is a what is this thing a U T X eighty five? Oh, it's U T X eighty five. Okay, I didn't. Yeah. I couldn't see. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Now yeah. I can see. Yep, yep. Yeah, U T X eighty five, and then I had it yep. lasered at. Yeah, I had it lasered at PBK in Vegas. I don't know if you've ever been there. It's like a little mm -hmm. tiny, little tiny uh, store in Vegas, but they have a, they have all the Microtechs you can. I think they're the biggest distributor for Microtechs. Yeah, they're pretty so, large. Yeah, there's a lot of gun guys when they're in Vegas. They go to that store and buy Microtechs and stuff. One of my friends. And just what I needed to hear. Yeah. <laughs> another, another another way to go broken day. Yeah, awesome. exactly. You were only in you were only at Shot Show for like what a day? No, I was there a couple days. A couple days? I did not see you that whole time. Out. Huh? Yep. I and didn't so see I you. came back. I had I don't know. I felt a little sick for like two days, mm -hmm. and then uh, Jason got strep throat, pneumonia, and flu A. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> he was laid up for a week and a half. What was he doing in Vegas? <laughs> I don't know, Jeez, man, but Jason. I shook the same hands, touched the same guns, <laughs> oh. and we stayed in the same room, Ooh. so I don't know how in the world he got all that, and I got away with just basically a sniffle. You're probably immune at this point. Maybe. I've been yeah. exposed to about everything except yeah. the uh, coronavirus. I remember. And that, that, man, that may still happen, so. Yeah. Uh, you've Well, I remember the time at Vegas a long time ago when you were literally green. Oh, yeah. yeah. I got the flu really bad. Uh, yeah. That was like the hospitalization flu. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I did not see you. I had all these jokes and stuff like that. You know, when I figured out you're coming to Vegas, I have all these jokes like, this must be the ghost of Mac. We're never supposed yeah. to see you. <laughs> it's a funny you. Story. So I went to the emergency <laughs> room and, and I was like on my deathbed and they they uh, they said, well, we can give you the you know the Tamiflu, but some, sometimes the symptoms are as bad or worse than the flu itself. And I said, mm -hmm. well, I can't do that. I'm in town for a trade show, and I'm like laid up in bed. Is 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 there anything you can give me that can get me through the day? You know, and and um, they gave me a prescription for something. I went to Walgreens on the strip and got it filled. Went back to Circus Circus to my dank little hotel room. Mm -hmm. Didn't read the the label. Uh, didn't Google it. And so I went to bed, woke up in the morning, and I thought, well, you know, if one's good, two's better. And I took two of them. <laughs> and I got to the show, and, and Aaron was with me, and, and uh, I just got pale and about dropped. Mm. And uh, he's like, dude, you need to go back to the hotel room. And I said, yeah, let's go back. And, I, you know, it gets me back to the hotel room. And I lay down, and when I finally, you know, get my senses about me again, I Google what it is. And it's like some super powerful opioid yeah. she'd given me. Do you remember Not, what the name of it was? I could check with Lola. Oh, and okay. 
And I was like, holy smokes. Mm -hmm. It was like some, man, I guess, you know, opioids or something can get you through the flu. I didn't know that. And uh, not yeah. all of us could take those either. I, I can't take any opioids. That's See, I can't do morphine. She did ask if, what I'm allergic to. And I said morphine. But uh, hmm. so I, I guess that's she said, like, OK, you know, here's something just as bad or worse. Hmm. Take this. OK. And she didn't say, don't take two, just yeah. take one. You sound just... like half of Lola's patients. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that don't seek. Uh, you got to tell them everything not to do, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, actually, oh, I see her. Out of the other end, only take one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. I hate take, I don't like uh, taking drugs at all. Mm -mm. I'm mm -mm. not a fan of it. I no, think, I don't like yeah. being goofed up, man. That's why I don't drink and stuff. It just, ugh. Yeah. Uh, I think the whole pharmacy thing is a conspiracy. And I know Lola's a <laughs> oh, pharmacist. We we have... <laughs> I know, Lola's right, a pharmacist. We yeah. have this argument all the time. <laughs> do I back? Oh, no, they got, no, the boys got vaccinated and all that kind of stuff. But I just think the whole pharmacy thing is crazy now. I think yeah. it's crazy. Yeah. And then the next thing you know, yeah. they'll flip it on us and they'll just use vending machines. Oh, I know. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, so. it, it's a good argument against capitalism when people, you know, say, oh, so you're a, a free market capitalist. You say, yeah. And then they go, well, what about pharmaceuticals? Yeah. No. OK, yeah. so you pull out the one thing that, you know, people abuse the hell out of and yeah. screw patients over with. But there's I don't know if anyone watches Rick and Morty other than me, but there's a Rick and Morty where like the alien planet takes over Earth and they're just giving everyone pills. Like pills for breakfast, <laughs> pills for lunch. That would probably work. <laughs> yeah, I pills with a side of pills. In like 1960s. <laughs> Purple yeah. haze. Like here, some for everybody. Yeah. Uh, shooting gallery, and he gave us five bucks. He says, hey, hey, what's crack a in everyone? So shout shout out to him. Kathleen said that uh, she hit the vitamin C. Yeah, I was doing the, uh, and you know, come to think of it, Jason wasn't. I was taking uh, all sorts of supplements. Mm-hmm. And uh, everything from elderberry supplements to, you oh, know, okay. um, uh, what's that, you know, zinc and B um, and C. And I mean, I was just, yeah. I was overdosing on the stuff every day. Yeah. Maybe that's what saved me. Hmm. Vitamin C is good. It is to, to get a lot of that stuff in your system is good because I think your body cannot uh, absorb vitamin C, but it'll, it'll help flush everything out with it on the way out. So I think that's the yeah. whole thing. So a greasy saying. hamburger in my case, but <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> a greasy hamburger in Vegas is like <laughs> what is that? Like twenty five bucks? <laughs> what a greasy hamburger at least, <laughs> even at McDonald's. Yeah, not even I've... a good one. Yeah, <laughs> very very expensive. Make sure to check out HankStrange.com. You can sign up for our email list and find ways to follow and support our efforts.